The 2016 Audi RS7 Sportback Performance American performance is usually served with unmistakable flamboyance. For example, both the shark-nosed Corvette Z06 and Terminator-esque Shelby GT350 Mustang offer unambiguous speed cues front to back. But that's a good thing, it's an essential facet of their character. However, some people prefer the straight-to-jail speed in a package that flies comfortably under the radar. Folks looking for a combination like that usually turn to Europe, birthplace of cars like the Audi 7 Rupees Sportback Performance. To the uninitiated, it's just another AWD luxury sedan. But to those who know, it's over 600 horsepower and a top speed of 190 miles per hour. Audi already offers US customers the venerable 7 rupees, but now, according to a recent report from the fine folks at Autoblog, we'll get the new performance version as well. That means even more power, slightly tweaked styling, and all the refinement and comfort you'd expect from a range topper with four rings on the grill. So then, a high output variant of an already overpowered luxury sedan. Sounds tempting. We won't know exactly what the US spec 7 rupees sportback performance will bring to the table until Audi provides us with the details, but for now, read on for the Euro spec iteration and cross your fingers it's unaltered by the time it hits our shores. Updated the 12th of February 2016, Audi dropped a pretty cool commercial title, Teardrop, for its latest 7 rupees sportback performance. Hit play to watch it. Continue reading to learn more about the Audi 7 rupees sportback performance. Exterior, while the 7 rupees isn't exactly a car I'd classify as a sleeper, it still looks quite modest next to cars with similar levels of output. Audi's large single-frame grille dominates the front end, flanked on either side by sharp and narrow LED headlights. Moving towards the back, the lines are flowing and smooth, with a dearth of superfluous design cues. The proportions are attractive, and the roof slopes gently into a rear end that drops abruptly into the trunk. You could even get away with calling it minimalist. The 7 rupees Sportback performance keeps all these traits as is, and it's not easy to spot the differences between the performance and the normal 7 rupees. The 7 rupees Sportback performance keeps all these traits as is, and it's not easy to spot the differences between the performance and the normal 7 rupees. The bumpers keep the large intakes up front and exhaust housing diffuser in back. The grille still uses a glossy black honeycomb pattern, and the side skirts are flared. But look closely, and you'll see the performance comes with a Quattro logo in the lower portion of the grille. There's also matte titanium look trim used in the front spoiler, lateral intake flaps, side windows, and the top edge of the diffuser. The side view mirrors get this treatment as well. Further flare can be had with available aluminum, carbon, and gloss black styling packages, each model comes standard with 21-inch cast aluminum wheels, with the 7 rupees Sportback performance benefiting from an exclusive 5 double arm look design, complete with matte titanium look and gloss turned finish. The rollers are also offered in silver or gloss anthracite black, paint options come in a variety of finishes as well, such as solid, metallic pearl effect, crystal effect, and matte. Color choices include Daytona Gray, Floret Silver, Glacier White, Masano Red, Mythos Black, Nardo Gray, Panther Black, Prism Silver, and Sepring Blue. However, my favorite has to be the RS Performance Model exclusive Ascari Blue Metallic. Black and Blue Bruiser, Baby, Interior, the 4-door 7 rupees Sportback Performance makes decent use of available space when it comes to hauling around people and things. There's seating for four passengers, with more space in the back than most 190 mph performance vehicles. There's also up to 49.1 cubic feet of cargo capacity, up front are standard sport seats with large side bolsters and integrated head restraints. Opt for the RS Performance Design Package, and Audi will upholster the seats in an Alcantara leather combo, with black and blue coloring and a honeycomb pattern. The package also throws in matching contrast stitching on the armrests, control elements, and floor maps, plus Alcantara and Carbon Twill Blue inlays for the knee pads. Further color options for the upholstery and stitching are offered with Audi exclusive portfolio, up front are standard sport seats with large side bolsters and integrated head restraints, behind the leather-clad, flat-bottomed, three-spoke multifunction steering wheel is instrumentation that includes a black background, white numbers, and red needles. 
The entry sills are illuminated, and there's a power retractable display mounted on top of the dash for infotainment and navigation purposes. Standard equipment includes four zone climate control and MMI navigation with touchpad control. Options include a heads up display, a premium Bang & Olufsen sound system, and driver's aids like night vision assistant and adaptive cruise control with stop and go functionality. You can also get Audi Connect for a variety of online services, plus an internet Wi-Fi hotspot, drivetrain, so it looks good and the interior is nicely equipped. But what about all this performance we keep hearing about? True to the car's namesake, Audi and Quattro GmbH bless the 7 rupees sportback performance with the most powerful version of the makes twin turbo 4.0 liter TFSI V8 engine. Peak output is rated at 605 horsepower between 6,100 and 6,800 revolutions per minute, and 516 pound-feet of torque between 1,750 and 6,000 revolutions per minute. Set the driving mode to dynamic and step on the throttle, and you'll activate an overboost function that temporarily increases peak torque to 553 pound-feet between 2,500 and 5,500 revolutions per minute, making the boost gauge glow red. All told, that's 45 horsepower and 37 pound-feet more than the standard 7 rupees. Engine redline was also raised by 200 revolutions per minute. The new 7 rupees performance edition goes from 0 to 100 km per hour, 62 miles per hour in 3.7 seconds, 0.2 seconds quicker than the base 7 rupees. The result is a sprint from 0 to 100 km per hour, 62 miles per hour in 3.7 seconds, 0.2 seconds quicker than the base 7 rupees. The performance will also go from 0 to 200 km per hour, 124 miles per hour in 12.1 seconds, 1.4 seconds quicker than the base 7 rupees. Top speed is electronically limited to 155 miles per hour, but ask Audi nicely, and they'll ditch the nanny for a top speed of 174 miles per hour. Equip the optional dynamic package, and the performance will max out at a heady 190 miles per hour. Twin scroll turbochargers make the boost. The snails and their associated intercoolers are mounted directly into the engine's inner V, which helps to reduce turbo lag and sharpens throttle response. The powerplant also comes with Audi's cylinder on demand COD system, which closes valves and cuts fuel to cylinders 2, 3, 5, and 8 under light load. This system essentially turns the thirsty 4.0 liter V8 into a 4 banger when cruising, improving fuel economy substantially. That means the performance returns the same mileage and emissions as its non-performance siblings, with just under 25 mpg and 356 grams per mile, respectively. Routing the power is a standard 8-speed Tiptronic torque converter transmission. Coolant is routed from the engine to help the gearbox reach optimum operating temperature more quickly, while a hydraulic accumulator is used for start-stop functionality. Drivers can use a steering wheel mounted button to select between comfort, auto, dynamic, and individual modes. The Audi Drive Select system offers multiple driving modes, modifying settings for the steering, engine, and transmission depending on the situation. Drivers can use a steering wheel mounted button to select between comfort, auto, dynamic, and individual modes, similar to the new Audi R8. There are also paddles mounted on the steering wheel for manual shifting. Rev counts appear on the information screen behind the wheel, or on the optional heads-up display. Finally, Audi's iconic Quattro permanent AWD system puts it all to the ground. The system comes with wheel-selective torque control, with normal operation sending 40% to the front axle and 60% to the rear. There's also an optional sport differential for the rear that uses two superposition gears for smoother torque distribution. Audi says the diff literally pushes the RS performance models into the radius in fast turns. Chassis and handling. The 7 rupees sportback performance has a 5 link suspension setup in the front and a trapezoidal link in the rear. Both are made from aluminum. The wheel carriers and pivot bearings are also made from aluminum and the stabilizer bars are hollow. Hydraulically damped bearings are used to join the steel subframe and body. Each model comes standard with adaptive performance air suspension, which varies settings depending on road conditions, driving style, and driving mode. For example, put it in dynamic mode, and the ride height drops 0.8 inch. 
Audi also offers stiffer RS sport suspension with dynamic ride control, which replaces the stock pieces with steel springs and three-stage adjustable dampers. Other options include dynamic steering with a continuously variable ratio. Braking comes from 15.4-inch rotors and six-piston calipers up front, which have a weight-saving design that cuts 6.6 .6 pounds over normal discs. Finally, there are available carbon fiber ceramic discs that shed an additional 22 pounds. Drivetrain Specifications Safety Neither the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration nor the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety have posted crash test results for the 7 rupees. However, standard equipment does include dual-stage front airbags, front thorax side airbags, knee airbags, curtain airbags, abs, EBD, latch anchor points in the rear, and LED lighting. Prices Sales in Germany will begin this November with an MSRP of €121,700 At that price, the performance would carry a $24,824 premium over the standard rupees. When and if the performance makes it to the US, I'd expect it to cost roughly $135,000 before options. And don't forget there are plenty of four-digit add-ons to tack on before you drive away, such as new exterior trim, driver's aid technology, premium audio, and the speed-enhancing dynamics package. On the US market the 7 rupees performance will be priced from $129,000. Competition. BMW Alpina B6 Grand Coupe. Bimmer calls it a coupe, but this luxury speedboat still boasts four doors, just like the Audi. Other similarities include a gently sloping roofline and a twin-turbo V8 nestled in the nose. Output is rated at 600 horsepower and 590 pound-feet of torque. Properly routed through the standard 8-speed automatic transmission and BMW's X-Drive AWD system, acceleration figures look like 0 to 60 mph in 3.6 seconds and a top speed of 200 mph. Adaptive sport suspension comes standard. Pricing starts at $122,200. Read our full review here. Mercedes-Benz AMG CLS 63S when it comes to Mercedes, more letters means more speed. Such is the case with this four-door coupe, which gets the AMG Go Faster treatment with a 5.5-liter twin-turbo V8 good for 577 horsepower and 590 pound-feet of torque. Other features include a 7-speed automatic transmission and Merck's 4 Modic AWD system. A sprint to 60 miles per hour takes just 3.5 seconds, while top speed is electronically limited to 155 miles per hour. Between the Audi and BMW, the Merc is probably the most brutal of the three, with huge displacement and beefy looks. It's also the least expensive, starting at $107,800. Read our full review here. Conclusion this is a segment that promises everything. The practicality of four doors combined with the good looks of swept back rooflines, while high technology and world-class comfort pair up with breathtaking speed. Anyone willing to spend this kind of coin on a car is simply unwilling to compromise, no matter the situation. With that in mind, how does the 7 rupees sportback performance stack up? With over 600 horsepower on tap, the Audi has the muscle, while the adjustable suspension finds a happy balance between refinement and cornering prowess. You'll also find options like ceramic brakes to gain an edge come Sunday. Inside, Audi brings top shelf materials and the latest techno gadgetry. All in all, things are as they should be. So why would you pick the Audi over the BMW or Mercedes? In a word, maturity. While the BMW and Mercedes announce their presence with showy styling and faster-than-you attitude, the Audi brings a uniquely restrained confidence. On most days, it'll easily cruise to your destination with discretion. But dig into the loud pedal, and it's all sound and fury. Love it even more performance understated exterior go faster options. Leave it very expensive BMW and Mercedes offer even more performance not yet confirmed for the US updated history.
Updated November 27, 2015, Audi dropped a new video in which it highlights its latest 7 rupees sportback performance. Hit play to watch the new 7 rupees in action on some very cool winding roads. Updated November 20, 2015, we added a series of new images and one new video taken during the car's official presentation at the 2015 Los Angeles Auto Show. Updated the 12th of November 2015, Audi announced that the new 7 rupees performance will be making its North American debut at the 2015 Los Angeles Auto Show and will be put on sale in December. Prices will start from $129,000. If you liked this video, please share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to hit the subscribe button.